<laughs> you know, March is Multiple Sclerosis Awareness Month, and here to talk about it today, Neil Cavuto, the anchor and managing editor of Business News for Fox Business Network and the Fox News Channel. Neil, great to have you here. Thank you, George. Thanks for, thanks for coming in. I know you were diagnosed back in, what, 1997? Yeah, it's been a while. MS, and you've, you know, you've inspired so many people by dealing with it in such a public way, but that's not always easy. It's not always easy, but, uh, you know, it, it, it is what it is, you know. You, you know, in life, things come our way that we can't control. Believe me, I'll milk it, George, when it comes to doing <laughs> chores at home. But even my wife will say the garbage isn't going to walk itself out there. So uh, I just try to tell people with the disease or any kind of malady, you know, life is, you know, as John Kennedy once said, unfair. But you just have to deal. But what are the special challenges in trying to do live television when you're dealing with MS? Well, I think my producers could tell you that they'll know something's wrong when I can't see or um, I'm having trouble looking at, at the prompter. Uh, now, you don't need prompter, but those days that I do, <laughs> I, I try to pre-memorize the script. Uh, or try to remember the guest. Sometimes it's very difficult to see the person right in front of me. Uh, it, it just depends on the day. It's a disease that manifests itself in a variety of ways. Well, and that's the thing. So many people who struggle with MS, they have to be in, in, in such tune with their body so they can feel the signs right. coming on. I think that's what's it. I mean, I think that uh, I had cancer prior to this, and as awful as that was, George, there was an end game if the chemotherapy and the radiation succeeded. With MS, it's really not so easy, and, and as it progresses, and mine is progressing, you, 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 you never know how it will hit. I think the biggest adjustment I had when I first got diagnosed was uh, understanding a limb that would go out and compensating with the other limb, an eye that goes out, compensating with the other eye, both eyes go out just feel words and it gets bizarre but you read your body after a while and you realize that hey look we can do this and i know yeah i remember Aunt robin talking to ann romney who of course right, is dealing right. with MS as well and how she handled it during the campaign and you've teamed up with her in her am not ann romney neurological center yeah she had asked me uh when she was coming up with this idea and i wanted to run it by the higher ups at fox but it was a bipartisan effort to deal with a host of neurological ailments that are joined kind of at the neurological hip here, I'm talking about Parkinson's, uh, Lou Gehrig's disease, multiple sclerosis, uh, and she was trying to find a common theme for this. But it's a board that is as bipartisan as you can get. Chelsea Clinton and her husband are on it, uh, former Congressman Kennedy in Massachusetts. Uh, and I, I like the fact that it's bipartisan in that, you know, a disease like this doesn't recognize either your politics or your wealth or your status. It hits everybody. That's an important message. I know you're going to help a lot of people. Neil Cavuto, thanks for coming. Thanks, on this very much.